Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I am Shristi Kumar and I am a third year medical student at KIST Medical College. So today this video is going to be about mostly uh, like a Q&A video about the questions you guys have asked uh, to me about different medical colleges in Nepal. There will be different portions. So first it will be a brief about different medical colleges and since I am a student from KIST Medical College I, I will describe more about my colleagues and I've been these past few um, months I've been receiving tons and tons of questions from you guys in my social media account so rather than uh, replying to it individually I want to address it in a video form so that it will be helpful for everyone so basically there are um, different medical colleges in Nepal which are affiliated to mainly two universities which is uh, Tribhuvan University the TU and Kathmandu University which is KU so there is also another medical college which is BPKSS and it is um, not affiliated to either TU or KU it is affiliated to um, BPKSS Autonomous Health and Sciences University and while considering for um, priority order or priority list i won't go much detail into this because i believe it's your own personal thing uh, you should know what your priority is in terms of where you want to study rather than going into the mass or whatever some person is saying i think it has to be yours but but everybody has to consider a few things which is first things first your choice second thing is based on um again it's all about your own preferences um, whether you want it to be near to where you live or you want based on academics based on university lots of people choose based on university as well based on fees based on hostel facilities and a lot of things so KIST Medical College is located in Guarco Lalipur and it has separate locations for the IBMS which is integrated basic medical sciences building where you will be studying for two years and hospital is a bit um, far, uh, farther from where the basic medical college science building is in um, where you will, you will be learning ab about more about your clinical and as you all might know MBBS journey is a complete of five year long journey and you have to do one year internships and for those uh, of students who are um, studying in scholarships I believe they have bondings for like two years in different areas of Nepal into the fees um, about um, studying uh, medical medical sciences for foreign students the fees is as per that is decided by the uh, Medical Education Council Nepal the total fees I think in our time it was something around 40 lakhs so it keeps on changing every year this also has been a uh, confusion among a lot of students like how much should we pay uh, how is the how are we paying it um, the total fees is about around 40 lakhs I think this year it is 41 something so um, that should be paid in three installments which is one uh, at the time of admission in our college um, the second installment is paid after your first year exams and the third installment is paid before your second year exams so that's how you pay the full fees and a lot of students ask me about the extra fees um, for KIST medical colleges there are no extra fees taken obviously there are hostel fee fees excluded and hostel is not compulsory in our college I will again come to that later next section is academics um, for the past few years that I've spent my time in KIST medical college the academic Academics is perfect you know for um, basic medical science students it's very strict teachers everyone is very strict about your studies if you are not passing if your attendance is not full or um, whatever it's required I think 80 to 90 percent I'm not sure about that but if all of those requirements are not met you are gonna be in trouble so you have to be a very good student as well as maintain your academics you have to in our college especially you have to do well in your internal exams as well I believe KIST Medical College is very strict regarding the academics and hence the results as well we can see uh, the past history uh, that our college has been doing very well um, in terms of results and I am also the student who won't compare results to the students knowledge um, that's a separate thing maybe we can talk about it in a separate video uh, but yeah 
academics is perfect you don't have to worry about it anything as long as you are a very hardworking student and you want to do good I think you will excel in medical school you know but if you like miss out and slack in a bit or avoid your books and do not prioritize studying I think it's gonna be a trouble for you so your academics is in your hand but speaking for Kist Medical College and basic medical science studies there is amazing classes they we we almost never get holidays you know that's one thing that is like very sad but i think it's all worth it because after the second year you are going to get so much holiday that you will have time for everything so study when there is time to study and play when there is time to play you know so other things a lot of students have asked me about is um extracurricular activities or sports so um we do have a lot of extracurricular activities we do participate in um intermedical colleges competition apart from that we host our own extracurricular activities um we have kissed uh, kissed fest um every two years um you know we have a uh, sports week road track club of Kist medical college is very active in organizing different events for the medical student as well so a lot of things uh, you don't have to worry about sports but yeah there is one drawback that is not having a um, you know sports ground sports like football and basketball but if there is a will there is always a way talking about hostel situation yes there is hostel available in Kist Medical College there are buildings for girls hostel and boys hostel um, in IBMS building uh, itself but uh, for the past recent years it has been open for mostly international students so students from different um, countries uh, reside in those hostels apart from that there are plenty of hostels which are available outside of college as well in the hostel it's not too bad um, the hostels but at the periphery of college you know um, the environment is cool I can speak for the hostel where where I had lived um i think the food was good and the cost was feasible for me you know it was affordable and there was very friendly environment among the um hostel staffs and student um, and the hostelers and one of the most asked question about kist medical college is the patient flow i'm very new to this clinical world um and um but we have had postings in our first year as well as second year so we have had posting experiences we have gone to we have gone to hospital and conducted multiple programs during breastfeeding week as well we conducted programs at pediatric ward and um where um, an immunization center so um there were adequate patients you know it's not like what is hospital without patients you know so there are half patients there are patients um and obviously if you compare it with iom and i mean mmc and case obviously it's a public government hospital and it's a private hospital there will be difference but in terms of facilities and um patient care and Regarding everything, Christ Medical College hasn't been behind in anything. From what I've heard from my seniors, patient flow is adequate. There is very friendly environment. Um, our teachers, they are amazing teachers from basic, from basic medical sciences. So, uh, they are very supportive, amazing teachers. A lot of my teachers watch my videos as well, and they are, they always like motivate me. You know. Um, uh, tell me to create videos some teachers they would give me a uh, topic ideas like you should create videos like this you know and when is your next video coming um teachers are very supportive and i love that about kist um, our teachers are also involved in extracurricular activities you know our teachers um involved and uh, during our concerts that happens at the end of kist fest uh, some of our teachers sang as well so it's i really love that bonding between st students and teachers they are always very um they're always there for students you know whenever you have questions to ask about any subject uh, even during holidays they respond very quickly and they answer to your questions and there is no like judgment um and also no hesitancy from students in asking teachers questions like you know it's a very friendly environment here in kist and i think for foreign students as well you do not have to worry like especially for Indian students I think there were like 14 students in my junior batch in, in my junior batch and then eight in the following year I think so there are plenty of um, 
you know international students as well so, but also I'm always there um, if any of you want to know more about KIST or more about first years and how to study in medical school I can always um, I'm always there you can always ask me your queries so you guys know like uh, senior junior environment everybody is very uplifting and very positive so um, if you're choosing KIST welcome to our welcome to KIST medical college and okay guys this video was a short video because I I got lots and lots of DMs about uh, all of these queries if you have more you can comment down below I will reply it and if you have more types of video that you want to you want me to make I will be making those in coming days um, thank you for supporting me thank you for following my journey through medical school I am very grateful as always and please 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 give this video a like and comment your queries and I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.